شهر رمضان الذي أنزل فيه القرآن هدى للناس وبينات من الهدى وبينات من الهدى والفرقان فمن شهد منكم الشهر فليسم ومن كان مريضا أو على سفر فإدة من أيام أخر يريد الله بكم اليسر ولا يريد بكم الأسر ولتكمل العدة ولتكمل العدة ولتكبر الله على ما هداكم ولعلكم تشكرون الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين نبينا محمد صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وأصحابه وبعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أولنا أموات حسين ومتري ورنت عريا أبو جانا جينا ومتي كبات الدبسي من رمضان ومنا إن أدماء الله تعالى إسلام ومشكالي جودي إيماني Tuyo baka mkurulu za mutashi ni na mkwana ajia Hari ya nzuhu Mwana chumwa na nishura mi tali Mwaraka Shuri shafad Za mutashi kaka kaka haya tukari Nda talatin Nda uku Nda Allah takala mikirwa Nda kuta hikichiwa Wa inna luka وإن لوطا لمن المرسلين. للي أنا بلوط عليه الصلاة والسلام ينا أشكم وأعيني منزلي الله أتبت دا أنا بلوط عليه الصلاة والسلام شو عند شيء الله يزابا يباس درجة كان نبتة دكوم وأعيني منزلي. أنا بلوط عليه الصلاة والسلام يا أبو قرماء دم جانا سام سبو دم يما يا أبو أبو دابيو فالكو شركة نبيو كما واتو لواتي شيني نمجي يبار بار نمجي ليه بيابو كاتن سنة شعوة ودوانا واتو Aiki ya munana Yena chiki manye manye anka bahirai Wada adabi nuru Ya kusikanjibu jama ansa Waja mko bansu Ndahana asu Nisahiwa akang haramchi wana Mumuna aiki Allah ya za abeshi manzoni Chiki manye manye anka bahansa Na Kutu Safad Vers 133 where Allah Most High starts telling us about another great messenger of his that was Lord alayhi salatu wasalam who confronted evil doers, those who were practicing uh, uh, a great sin of homosexuality which is a practice whereby a man approaches a man, a woman approaches a woman in order to satisfy their desires. These contradict the natural, uh, the natural status that Allah Subhanahu wa Taala placed or created human beings. Allah says, "Wa inna lutan lamin al mursalin." Certainly, Lut lamin al mursalin was one of the messengers of Allah. Allah Most High sent them, I sent him to confront those people who were indeed criminal enough. Number one, through committing shirk, and number two, through committing liwat, a sin that had never been committed by any other generation before them. Ibn Jainahu wa ahlahu wa jama'in. To go to Allah Tabarak wa ta'ala, who on loka chi, yen aku kutit da bayan sana gari, idam wa tu aynin adaba tazu irman. أنا بلوتو عليه الصلاة والسلام يا أيها الذين متعنون سكري تعالى يا أيها مسوا الذين سدين الواد أما ما في يوان تشنش كيسكين سكتشبت شكبر الشركة 
suka ci gaba da wallawaki yin yin yawaki wato na muje barbaran na muje dan uwansa Allah ta'ala yana cewa mana nan wa in idna jayna hu alamu ka tuna yayin da muka wato ainihin kudar da shi wato shi annabi lut da kuma wato ainihin iyalansa a jama'in dukan shi a muna sani cewa wannan lamari na annabi lut ba kan kai alamari bane ba bane a wajen Allah ta'ala domin Allah ta'ala ya kawo kissan annabi lut a wurare da bazda Allah ta'ala ya ce wa lutan isqala li qaumi ata'tuna al-fahisha kama sabaka kun biha min ahli min al-alamin innakum la ta'tuna ar-rijala shahwatan min duni an-nisa bal antum qaumun musrifun fama kana jawaba qaumihi illa an qalu akhrijuhum min qaryatikum innahum unasi mutahharun fa anjaynahu wa ahlahu illa ratul kana min adabi wa amtarna alayhi matara fanbu kifa kana aqibatul mujrimin Allah ta'ala ya ce annabi lut ya kira mutanen sa ya ya kuke zuwa da alfasha domin wannan aiki na barbaran namiji kusanci dan uwansa namiji da neman sha'awa da biyan bukata alfasha ne babba ya ya kuke aikata irin wannan alfasha ata atuna alfahishata ma sabaka kun biha min ahli min al-ahli babu wani addu'iya wadda ya riga mutanen annabi lutu wannan fasadi da wannan farka ba a taba yin wata al'umma wacce namiji ke barbaran dan uwansa namiji ba sai aka mutanen annabi lutu alayhi salatu shi sa'a ta'ala ce ma sabaka kun ba a taba gabatan ku ba a riga ku wannan farka min ahli min al-ahli din duniya ba ta samu da wannan inna kun la ta'tuna rijalan shahwa min duni nisa kuna zuma wa maza ayan wanku ku bar mata bala an tuko musulfi ku mutane ne mu barata idan ana ne mu masu barna masu shi masu wuce iyaka da mutane a bin lutu alayhi salatu wasallam ce kullus da ya wannan kira ni mu kun ayyada a tuba dusi mutanen su ke da Allah ta'ala ce fa kan jawabu illa an kalu akhrijuhum min qaryatin ba su da wani jawabi da suka bayar illa cewa wadda annabi lutu da wa'annan yan tsararun daga wato ainihin kasar ke dan ya nuna cewa barnan da manya da kanana shagabanni da masu kudi talaka da suna ce tunda ya zama annabi lutu yan tsararu ne kana akhrijuhum min qaryatin inna hum unasun yadhkuru kutta su don mutane ne masu neman tsarkaka masu neman tsarkake su masu neman matsayi masu neman a ce su wan ka kone saboda kadan kada ne ku fadda su da garin ku to da suka yi wannan shine Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala kuma dake wata ke a kanshi sai ji fa an jaina wa alahu illa ra'atu tare min al-dabi sai muka kuɗin da annabi ne a lut da yan uwa wato wato mabiya bayan sa amma akwai matar sa a nabi lut duk wannan mu'azan da ake yi tana gidan a nabi lut amma da ita ake yi in karin da wasu sosai akan ta sai abin ya baka mamaki cewa da ita ake matun nan da ita ake shiryawa warar ya ce ce sada to ita wannan tana cikin halin a nabi lut amma Allah bai kuɗe da ita tana cikin halakar ku Allah ta'ala ce wa amkarna alayhi matara muke musu ruwa ruwan duwar wasu aka yi musu ba ruwa irin wanda muke yi mutuwa ka samu ruwa ka tara ko ka sha ruwa ko ka abin nan a ruwan duwar su Allah ta'ala ne ya za a ce ana ruwa a ji duwar su sa sauko ai ka san bala'i duwar wasu aka daga sauka musu Allah ta'ala ce kai dubi kai dubi zuwa ga mutane wato mujirmai mabarfata to shi yasa annabi lut ya sha wahala kwarai da mutanen sa kuma wannan yana nuna maka duk inda ka kai da da'awa shirya ba ya hannun ka domin a ce dai daga cikin mutanen gidan sa ma tassa musamman a ce tana cikin wannan barata 
kamar yadda can muka ji labarin shi a Nabi Nuh dan sa shi ma na cewa da suka yadda kaga akwai kusanta tsakanin ubada akwai kusanta tsakanin miji da mata amma ba shi ba su yi ba tana cikin halakafi shi ma dan Nabi Nuh ya halaka shi ma ita ma ita ma matar a Nabi Lut da mata halaka to shi sa a wannan farna na liwadi ba karin farna ne kuma mu kasar mu ya kamata manyan musu ku ki mataki saboda can baya za ka ji akwai wani bill yana ta yawo wannan bill din a cikin sa akwai matsaloli daga ciki akwai inganta na miji a wurin na miji mace ta wurin mace wanda su turawa yanzu na yi a kasashen su kai ka dauko al'adan ba turin ka wani nan wurin muke da addini muna da al'ada wanda yake a kan sunna na da Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam muna da kunya mun san mutunci za ka shugabanni su tsayo ganin cewa irin wannan dokoki da ake masu wato ake kwaso su da kasashe da ba su da tsari ba su da tunani ba su san Allah ba to irin nan wannan bai kamata ana ma kawo shi ba bai kamata ba kuma zaman lafiyar shugaban dan mu shi ne irin wannan idan an zo da shi a shure domin talaka ba zai yadda da wannan ba dan musulmi na farai kai ko musulmi mai taba iya mai caca ba zai yadda a ci na miji a wannan mutum ne su can sai amma ban Allah ta'ala ya haramta wannan wato wato mu'amala ta a ce na miji na miji shi sa hukun hukunci da shari'a ta dauka akan wannan ta'asa za ka san malamai sun kai komo wajen me ya dace ai wa wanda ya yi wa'adi akan wasu me ya dace a mai wasu ka ce a dauke shi a matsayin wanda ya zina shi ne duk wanda yi a jefe shi har lahira ko yana da aure ko bai da shi kar abin banta saboda yayi aikin da dabbobi ba sa yi wasu ka ce a a ai abin da ya dace da shi wanda ya zana shi ne aure ko shi da ka sama a hau kaman zuma rob da helicopter sai a murkino shi dan ya zama to darasi ga wadansu wasu ka ce a kashe shi wadde da wanda aka yi da shi inda da yaddan su to do aka aka kashe aka kashe su kai in ka ji wadansu hukuncin kunci da babansu su kai a cikin mutabaina na hukunci kamar misali irin urtubi sai ka dauka cewa an yaku a ce ai wannan irin hukunci saboda munin munin a ce na miji ya barbar da masa kuma a sani da yawa wasu suna yi ma saboda go kai ne yace a ji ai domin kai tunani a kanka yaushe na miji zai ji sha'awar ta wasu ta yaya al'auransa ma za ta tashi to wannan hanya wasu yan shayi shayi ne dama wasu yan ci wasu idan ba su yi ba za su samu liki ba wasu a ci in ba su yi ba za su samu kudi ba ba za su yi kwarjari ba cikin jama'a idan suna yin an gan su da dinga tsoron su shekaru na za ka yi a duniya da za dinga tsoron ka ba gani ko ai zuwa bun tsoro yana barbaran na miji dan wanka Allah ya sauke in this surah Allah the most high is narrating the story of Lut alayhi salatu wasalam in a summary form however in other surahs Allah the most high discusses the qisa in detail he said in the jannah remember when we saved him in we saved lord alayhi salam wa ahlahu he and his family he and his followers ajma'in all of them were saved as a result of this the nasty act which allah subhanahu wa ta'ala through lord preached against lord told them that ataatun al-fahishata ma sabaqakum biha min ahad min al-alamin do you approach a kind of immorality 
which no, no generation in the history of the whole universe has ever committed, had ever committed it before you, you were the first to originate the committing of sodomy. So Lut was condemning that act and asking his people to reason why should they be those who will originate an act that is so nasty that none of the alamin had ever committed that. You do approach men with a view to satisfying your desire in doing in Nisa apart from women, contrary to women. And this is a practice that opposed to the nature of the whole humanity. Don't even mention Muslims, non-Muslims, pagans, and whoever this culture or this tradition opposed to the practice of all humanity. Even the animals do not used to commit liwat. But the people of Lut came to be the first people who initiated it on this earth. Lut stand firm. He preached against it. He condemned it. But still, they refused. They remained firm also fighting back Lut alayhi salam in order that they must continue committing such act. And as a result, in the end, after they defy all the warnings and admonition of Lut, Allah the Most High decided to get them perished by sending upon them rain of a bombs from the heavens. Allah the Most High said, We rain over them, on top of them. Rain of bombs from the heavens. Through that, Allah the Most High got all of them perished. So when that punishment came, Allah the Most High saved Lut and all his people. And from the indication of the Quran, those who believed in Lut were just few. And to your surprise, even his wife, the most closest person to him, disbelieved in him and she connived with those people and she supported them in committing this act and also in making sure that Lut was embarrassed. She used to inform her people whenever Lut had had visitors in order to come and approach them and in with a view to committing uh, homosexuality with those uh, people. Allah the Most High, even though he said wa ahlahu and his family, his wife was excluded because she did not belong to his family. His family here referred to those who believed in him either his children or anybody who believed in him fall under his family. So because of the nature of this crime that was committed by people of Lut, and it has also come to the generation of the Prophet wasallam, scholars give ruling. What is going to be the ruling and the punishment, the penalty that someone who commits liwad is going to serve? Some say that he should be punished the same way he who commits adultery or fornication should be punished. He should be killed. You see, anything which Islam said that someone should be killed must be a very, very grievous uh, sin. Some said that, no, his punishment should be in order to serve as deterrent to those who wanted to commit the same act, he should be carried to the highest elevation on that area, highest elevation. Maybe Zumarok, as Malam has mentioned, Zumarok is very high elevation. Maybe he should be taken with helicopter. When the helicopter drops on Zumarok, then that person should be, to be thrown down, rolled down from Zumarok to the ground. So that before he comes down, he must have broken into pieces. This will serve as deterrent for anybody who wanted to commit the one. And the, 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 the practice has become rampant to the extent that the source of permitting reward and those encouraging it among them are the soothsayers. People do consult them. You go and say, this is what I want. I need so-so-so position. I want a win, elective position, so-so elective position. I want to be an emir of my, my, my town and so on. They say, okay, no problem. We know what to do. 
what you should do is that go and be committing sodomy. Go and be a homosexual. With that, we are going to combine this and that. You will be the person to occupy that seat. With this, you see, the practice will continue to, to generate more and more people do enter into committing this, uh, this evil. Through soothsayers, through those people who will tell you that if you want to be rich, this is the way. You have to commit this nasty act. With this, you are going to be rich. Satan will help you. Ways will be made easy for you. And then you will be extremely rich. So for people to be rich, they, they, they prefer to leave Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and be committing this type of a crime which none of the generation among alameen had committed except the people of a Lord alayhi salam. In the jainahu ahlahu ajma'in, when we saved him, he and his uh, family ajma'in, all of them were saved from this uh, great affliction that descended on the people of Lord. Illa <laughs> the Palestine, the Syria, the Kasashiri, the Kiwi, and the So now I want to be to be the Kaswan Shakan. So like either Akadirka, you want to be to what a number of other last son of Biden went up in the world. You should learn about to never look at Zba. A ma, uh, one and a bit neighbor, Una, Dirka Jesuda, you must another. What Take to shi sa babu wanda ya san zukatan mutane idan ba ubangijin su ba Allah ka dai san abin da ke zuciyar mu da kai abin da gani shi zaka hukunci shi kaga annabi lut annabin Allah bai zargi matan sa dan bai sani ba sa abin da duk ya boye kar ka kai kai ba a kike kamar ka kuno shi Allah zai bayyana wannan gaba kai amfani da zahiri amma da yawa yanzu ka sa mutane suna saurin hukunta mutane da abin da ban tabbata ba Tagada and the Bill Yakamata, a Chiagano, but a Nayam, and out of the Gano, who is a liver. Who be a lay fever? She's a cool link with what I never done a giddy. Caracasoma the Gimani, Ah, Caraganisha the Kara, Ah, Yasuma Kiba, and I look at Yasuma Kiba. What I decided she did a Yima. Where's the Sabor Mota? Ah, and then I get a essay, Ah, Motor to Sun Aru, and I want her. So, what you want is a month to like a wide issue. Why can't she ask me? Kadinka so much any alkari to the towns that you are going to. I never looked down on the missile. No, she may say you go back to more. A mother allied to Jimotaki, Sakimotaki, I can't do that lesson. 
sai nan wani na nuna mutun kar mutun ya dinga fakewa yana farna dan mutane ba sani ba ya dinga shiga na addini shi da riga da rawani da tasbi amma criminal to ban wannan ba zai fitta ka ba kaga ita ai abin da take yin tana gidan annabin Allah tana abin nan da ga sai ga shi abu ya faru Allah ta ala hada da ita Allah ke tsayi ka all those who oppose Lut alayhi salatu wa salam were destroyed were seriously dealt with by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala therefore they got perished illa ajuzan fil ghabirin except an old woman fil ghabirin who remain among those who were destroyed all women here refer to the wife of Lut alayhi salatu wa salam who was supporting those people in that crime in that immorality while Lut did not know being the closest person to him should be the one who, who was supporting him who was helping him against those people but contrary to that she was in support of what they were doing and she was even showing them the way to that therefore she became among those who were destroyed allah the most high said when the punishment came he asked lut alayhi salatu wasalam to leave the town inside in the night fasri bi ahlika bi qit'in min al in in the night therefore when you were going out of the city let no one among you turn says to look back but it happened that his wife was among them therefore she turned allah the most high uh, dealt with her along with uh, those people we have so many lessons to learn from this verse allah the most high uh, did not make you to know that his wife was among them therefore she treated he treated her innocently as a righteous woman he related with her as his wife therefore that is how you should judge people do not continue suspecting people do not continue investigating what you are not supposed to investigate if you see somebody maybe has changed his clothes say aha so so something must have given him i saw him discussing with so 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 person maybe he must embezzle from his office maybe he committed one to a child or the other or you see him uh, adding weight say, aha these are the people living on haram you see he has eat, sat, started eating haram see how he's putting weight no one should think good of everybody except the contrary uh, manifest another very important lesson is that if one hides himself under the guise of the righteous people in the end if he is not righteous allah the most high will definitely expose him or her because allah knows whatever is in the heart of anybody at whatever given time and one cannot deceive allah one can only deceive human beings but in the end allah the most high will expose those who are hypocrite uh, covering themselves under under the cover of islam another thing is that relationship is of no benefit if you are not a believer being wife of a prophet he should have been saved he should be among those to be saved but that relationship did not benefit her because she did not believe in lord alayhi salam therefore she became among those who were perished thumma damarna al akhirin ta ma ta annabi lut alayhi salatu wasalam sai allah ya dirka ki sauran shi ma allah ta'ala ya halak da ruwan sama wadda ruwa ne na duwar wasu manya manya duwar su wadda suke ta sauka suka narkar da garin ga baki daya a wasu malamai na tarihi suka ce wannan wajen wajen dirkakewan yana wato ainin mataccen teku wadda a tu a tura ake cewa shi dead sea nan tsakanin jordan da wato ainin israel wadda duk da in ka lissa fa abun zaka samu yana kiwaye ne da urdun da falastin da wato ainihin suriya nan a wato ainihin gaban da shi ma laraba suke da wato ainihin iyaka da su a domin su bani israil da man da laraba kusan makwabtaka ya hada su a garuruwan nasu a mamannai ke da juna to shi sa makwabtakan ya sa su laraba su da labarin irin wannan mummunan dabi'a ake aikatawa kuma irin matsayi da Allah ta'ala ya dauka akan su daga ke su lokacin da ake ba Allah Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam wannan labari 
zamu zo maji cewa karin kan su laraba maka da suke fita kasuwanci su san labarin su san wurare kenan a hir a same ku cikin wannan farna domin kun san me ya faru da makwantan ku wai da suka yi wannan wato ainin gwamnanta a sa ba binda mu zai ba ka ta kaice anan ka san mu shine ka samu sulfu sulme cikin wannan sana'a har ma a ce ga wannan daudu nan shi aikin sa wannan aiki ya dinga wani kwalba da jiki yana wani wato canza murya kuma a tsakanin mu a ce ai dan daudu ne wannan ina 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 mutunci ina 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 abin nan ina ina kuma shi ma musulmi ne to shi sa wasu bala'on da ke abkan mana sanariyan su yawan sabon Allah tabaarak wa ta'ala wasu ka je abin nan muna bandit muna da biye muna da gasu nan kala kala yanzu abu yana ta addu'a saboda yawan farna da ke na sabon Allah tabaarak wa ta'ala ya za a yi kana musulmi wai ka kibe ka cewa kai dan daudu ne kuma ka dinga magana kana wani abun nan abin nan kana kana wani kar ka ta jiki ka ammace kuma ana ganin ka kuma an sani ko ba wani wataki Allah ya tsare unfortunately there was one day i went to day day i confronted some of these people i met someone who was working like that they say his name is a is a, I, I don't want to mention the name. So somebody came and touched me and said, "Ki da Allah kada ki kare ya ni." Yes. Ki ni kare ki kare just like a woman. Well, ya rabbi Allah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, "Wa innakum latamurruna alayhim musbihin." Latamurruna alayhim wa tu ainin kuna shuti wa kuna wuci wa kuna wato ainin zagayawa kuna 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 tafiye tafiye alayhim akan su musbihina da safe wato wato tafiye tafiye da kuke yi na wato a a a a a kasuwancin ku kukan wuce wuraren su da safe wayannan garuruwan nasu da muka ambata a su irin su urdun a irin su suriya su falastin uwa uba ita wannan wato ainin kogin mm matattan kogi dadsi inda abun ya ainin ya inda garin nasu inda durka ke kewan ya fawo to Allah ta'ala ce kuna wucewa idan kuna tafi tafiyanku da safi cikin tafiyanku za ku wuce wajen wa kenan ma kuna ganin warin tunda lokacin gari ya riga ya waye kuna ganin abin da aka yi musu durka kewa da gari ne tsayayye da gine ginin sa da mutane da kasuwa da alamuran gonakan su da kai da kowa amma ga shi yanzu zaman to tarihi to Allah ta'ala yana gaya wa mutanen maka cewa ku kun gani idan ma wadansu ba su gani ba to masu 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 yawo a cikin ku masu kasuwanci a cikin ku to sun wuce a garuruwan sun wuce daidai inda gaban da aka halaka mutanen annabi Lutu alayhi salatu wasallam musbihin na Allah the most high now is addressing the people of Makkah that this story that Allah is narrating was not a new thing to them they knew the point the, the location where it took place where Allah the most high destroyed those people you know you know the location all you people of Makkah so you should take lesson from that avoid committing immorality of that nature wa innakum latumuruna alayhim musbihin you are moving alayhim beside that location where these people were destroyed, destroyed most behind in the morning it was an area whereby arabs move around in order to transact their business around jordan palestine syria and so on that was that that is the area so it's not something that you do not know it's not something that was far away from you it was around your region therefore take lesson from that happening وَبِاللَّيْلِ أَفَلَا تَعْقِلُونَ لَا إِلَٰهَ إِلَّا اللَّهُ وَإِنَّكُمْ لَتَمُرُّونَ عَلَيْهِمْ مُصْبِحِينَ وَبِاللَّيْلِ كُن كَسَنْتُ كُنَا وَاتُ عَيْنٍ تَبِيتُ بِهِمْ كُنَا وُچُ وَنَّمْ وَلَا غَرِيْنَ إِنَّ وَنَّا أَبُنْ يَفَارُونَ دَسَافِيَا سَأَنَّ كُمَا دَرَمَا هَكَا بِمَا أَنَا تَبِيتُ بِهِمْ يَايَ وَيْتَ وَنَّا مَنْيُوِي دَدَرَيْنِ دَرَانِ كُنَا وُچُ أَكُنْ سَنْ وَجَا ba ba kuma ji ban ya yi ba 
saboda masu kasuwanci lokacin suna tafiya cikin ayari ni ka samu sun zo sun wato ainin sun aji yada zango a waje sa'an nan su matsa su saki yada zango a waje domin suna tafiya cikin ayari cikin jama'a saka za su ke tafiya dare za su ke tafiya rana tunda akwai aminci kamar ma yanzu a najeriya da ai za ka tafiya da koyo shiga rama ba ka da matsala ko za ka je inugo ko za ka je sokoto ko za ka je ilore ko za ka je ibadan ba ka da matsala dare ko rana to yanzu ba ai kuwa ya sani sai dai addu'a to su ma suna zaya da zango na tafi tafiyan su to suna tafiyan dare suna tafiyan rana Allah ta'ala ce ai da dare ma kun wuce wannan da ini ma kun wuce wannan da sami ma kuna wuce wannan sai Allah ta'ala ce afala taqilu ba za ku hankalta ba ku lura da wannan abin da ya faru ba za ku dauki darasi ba domin ku kada a same ku cikin wannan farko don mai hankali shi ke daukan daras kaga idan ya mun dan kwan kai kama wuta a sai ka shafa wani haka mene ruwa dan kare kama wuta za ka ma ana cewa ni su kun ga abin da ya faru idan ku skura kuma ku yi za ku ga abin da ya faru kamar ne zuwa a ce mana to kun ji abin da ku karanta to kada ku yadda a same ku cikin wannan farko idan aka same ku kuwa abin da ka samu na bala'i na azaba to ku kaje Allah ya kare The place where people of Lut were destroyed were, were destroyed was not far from your location. Therefore, you used to move around that area, most be hill in the morning, what be lay and in the night in your troubles. Afala taqilun Allah say, won't you reason? Won't you take lesson? To know that should that not guide you to avoid committing immorality of this nature, so that what happened to them will not happen to you. This is what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala meant for them. Let, let them take lesson from what happened to them so that they will not be also culprit of such. So also we, the Muslims who are reading the Quran also, this punishment is not far from anybody committing the same thing. So, afala ta'akilun, won't you reason, won't you understand, won't you fear Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to stay away from committing that type of sin so that Allah the Most High will preserve you and protect you because anybody who engages who indulges in this type of sin certainly Allah the most high will definitely punish him sooner or later if he did not repent wa inna yunusa lamin almursalin ay Allah ta'ala ya ba mu taitaccen bayani akan annabi lut da irin wato ainin barnan da suka yi da kuma yadda Allah ta'ala ya dirka ke su kuma mu dauki darasi daga wannan dan mu ni sanci wannan mummunan dabi'a kuma mu ma Allah ta'ala ya taimake mu mu kasance cikin wa'adda suke kokarin hanawa gurbadan hali ko da iku ne aka samu suna nuna wannan alama sai a kwafe su kuma ka bayar da muke cewa muna muna wato ainin jinjina ma shugabannin mu musamman wanda suka yi ruwa da tsaki wannan shure wannan kudura mummuna ta maida wato namiji a wani namiji doka ko mace ta wani mace doka kamar yadda luwadi tsakanin maza yake da muni haka nan shi ma ma digo tsakanin mata yake da muni su ma mace ta yi barbaran mace yanzu akwai shi ya ma fi na mazan yawa ne har za ka samu wata mai kudi hamsha kyar mai kudi za ta auri wasu matan su ne matan ta shi wa juna kwalliya kamar da kamar da mace za ta wa namiji kwalliya haka su ma za su wa junan su kwalliya suna abin nan suna shafa junan su kamar da mace zai sha namiji zai shafa mace munin sa shine yanzu mace za ga ta kamar kamila amma tana nan tana ta wannan barnan da yakuwa ta mace ina zaka ina zaka tunanin wannan mace inda ja wajen yakuwa ta mace wannan ta zaka yi mummuna ai babu shi to kuma abin ta kai shi shine abin ya shigo mana arewa a gidajen mu yayi kanta yayi muni sai ka samu yanzu ya zaman to abin alfari ga matattan mace ce fa amma ga matattan Allah ya tsare mana imani to bayan Allah ya ba mu issan shi annabi lut a takaice sai kuma yi dauko sabon wani annabi kamar yadda can baya ma mun ji da takaice takaitawa na annabawa da suka ba ta irin su annabi Musa da annabi Harun 
Musalat alaji lalle kuwa Yunusa yana cikin wato ainihin manzannin Allah tabarak wa ta'ala Yunusa ya sa shi ma kisan sa wato abin mamaki da darasi manya manya a ci amma yana daya daga cikin manya manya na ba masu yawan abutan Allah shi sa abutan Allah kariya ne ga mutum wajen fadawa cikin musiba da kuma kariya ne amma mutum ya fada dan sai Allah ya samu shi a insha Allah zamu kwana anan gobe da Allah ya kai mu zamu tashi a kan kisan shi annabi Yunus alayhi salatu wasalam amma a wannan uwa ne turo da baya kwana bi da sauki a kan annabi Yunus to za a samu bayani a takaice a kan sa insha Allah only that one to appreciate our lawmakers our senators who when that bill of legalizing same sex marriage sodomy and so on was presented they killed the bill uh, may allah the most high reward them because that is against our culture it's against our religion and it is against the practice of a normal human being so also apart from this practice of a reward which is between a man and a man there is also it's a opposite between a woman and a woman known as lesbianism whereby a rich woman if she engages in that she marry as many as uh, possible girls or women to be her wives the normal practice is that man will marry a woman but she also being a lesbian she marries as many as possible girls or women and what they are doing is this practice of lesbianism which has been condemned by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and Allah cast whoever engages in that may Allah purify our hearts may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us inshallah we are going to stop here tomorrow we are going to take another great personality among the messengers of Allah uh, that is going to be Yunus alayhi salatu wasalam Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. To daga cikin tambayoyin da muke da su dan wake cewa a malam mutun zai iya yi wa iyayen sa sadakatun jariya idan ba sa raye kamar gina masallaci ko makaranta suna suna samun lada. Eh mutun zai mutun zai iya yi haka saboda ya ma ta fada sunna cewa idan mutun ya mutu aikin sa su yanke sai abin da wato ainihin ya bari a baya daga ciki Allah ya ambaci wato ainihin a sadaka wacce ke gudana da kuma da wadda ya bari wadda yake aiki na kwarekin mai addu'a a ayyukan mutum ayyukan mutum babu sabani tsakanin malamai cewa idan dan mutum yayi wa mutum wani abu na alkhairi tuna da zai same shi kuma yi gina masallaci a gina mai wato ainihin bukatai na ruwa inda ruwa ke fitowa ana sha ko rija ko yi wani islamiya ko ya yi wani lambu wanda za a dinga zuwa ana cin ya'in itaciyen wajen duk suna cin abin da wato ainihin mutum zai yi wa iyayen sa duk abin da yana alkhairi da sunan su babu sabayi tsakanin malamai cewa ladi zai riske shi Allah ya samu dace The question of the brother is whether it is permissible or it is possible in Islam for a son to initiate something uh, maybe a project or something of that nature in the name of his late parent and whether that uh, will attract reward in their favor something like a sada pratijaria or for him to build a mosque with the intention of uh, dedicating it to his father Yes, it is permissible in Islam and it is possible if a son has the means to do something that will be attracting reward in favor of his father. Because to say that a son is part of the uh, deed of his father. So whatever one did of righteousness, by the grace of Allah, to see his father or his mother will have the reward even after they are dead. May Allah forgive them and forgive all of us. Idamu tunyazo yin sallar isha ko azahar amma ya samu liman ya riga ya raka abi shi idan an gama salla shi zai zai ida raka abi da fatiha da wata sura eh nam eh ana yawan tambaya akan wannan matsala ta cika salla idan mutum ya bi liman a 
ya rizki liman da usur kauyi ya zai biya na shar kauyi a idan mutum ya samu limamin da yake sallah sallah mai raka'a hudu kamar azhar misali ya samu raka'a biyu zai biya raka'a biyu idan ya tashi biya idan ya karanta sura da fatiya shine abin da ya rasa sallah sa tayi idan kuma ya karanta fatiya kadai bi ha da sura ba sallah sa tayi domin a wasu na ganin zai biya ne abin da ya rasa abin da ya rasa shine fatiha da sura sallah tayi wasu kuma suna ganin a cika sallah zai ba a fara sallah daga na karshe sallah da ka fara liman yana ta uku kana ta farko ne ba ta uku ke ba ba a so mu sallah daga ta uku wannan kuma shine gaskiya magana kuma shine fatawa mafi dace shi liman yana na uku ne amma kai kana na daye ne ai da kana na uku ne da ba kai sallama kai ma lokacin liman ya sallama to ka kana ta uku ne ka kana ta daye ne sa'an nan yayin ne na hudu kai kai ta biyu kai ta hiya in ka tashi abin da ya sauraro maka shine ta hudu ta hudu ta hudu da fati a kaushi amma mutane su samu nisuwa kowanne kai yi sallan ka tayi domin kar a je a ce ni gima akan cewa to ai wannan kaza ne wannan duk wanda yi kowanne sallah ta yi Allah ya samu ta ci a expression why by a person come a join congregational prayer a prayer of four rakats after the imam had performed two the first two rakats then how is going how is he going to make up the two rakat he missed the way you are going to make it up is that when they terminate their prayer you stand up and read fatiha each for each of the two rakats you missed this is the best way to go about it because you are building on what you get but not uh, uh, you are not making up exactly what you missed because the first two rakat the last two rakat of imam you got are your first two rakat therefore heaven observe the first two rakat what remain for you are the last two rakat and last two rakat what do you recite you recite fatiha each in each of the rakat however if you decide to make up exactly how you missed the prayers by reciting fatiha and surah in each of the rakat that one is uh, also acceptable but the best is for you to read fatiha fatiha in each of the rakat you are going to make up <coughs> tambaya tagaba said what is the ruling on drawing images of people in islam to gaskiya zanan abu mai rai gaba da haramun mutun ya zana abu mai rai ko dan adam ko doki ko tsuntsu ba dai dai bane domin a bise sun zo masu tsanani masu tsoratarwa akan duk abin da yake wadda ke zana abu mai rai ko wadda kyama za a sa shi hura mai rai saboda haka idan mutum zai yi abin nan na zane na kwallon zane to idan ga yin abin da ba mai rai ba idan za ka manna gidan ka kwalliya a daikunan ka a falon ka ka nemi abin da ba su da rai su wani kogi su wani ruwa yana zubowa su wasu itace abin nan abin nan kurmi misali cike da itace masu kwalliya ya zuba sallacin wannan zaka in ka in aso mu ruwa yanzu wannan itatuwan su kai kore sharaf zaka sun fito da kwalliya to irin wannan babu ne amma duk abu mai rai to to mutun ya hattara shi ko mai zanan ya hattara kare an ka sa shi a gaba ka ce sai ya samu sarai godiya ma an ka san ba zai sha ba har abu ne kana amma suna da girma a wannan alaji ba duk da wannan suna cewa ai zane ne ba gini bane abin da ake nufi wadda mutun yayi da laka wadda zai fid da inuwa to in dai abu mai rai ne to mutun ya misanci shi kwata kwata kare so ba hazarin yana da girma Allah ya tsaye a uh, drawing images of people in islam is forbidden it is haram for one to draw human beings or things that are, are living things there are so many ahadith warning against that 
one of them is that the Prophet Sallallahu mentioned that whoever does so, he will be compelled on the day of Qiyamah to blow salt, to make that thing living. It is not living, but he must make it living, while he cannot do. So in the end, he will end up in serving Allah's punishment. So we should be warned against that. If you want to grow or you want to correct the Apollo, do it with things that are not living, inanimate things, such as flowers, such as a waterfall, such as forest, and so on. This one will decorate your house or your, uh, your palo or something of that nature. So this is the best way about it. Tambaya Tagaba, Ikechab, Malam, Ya Halasta Musulmi, Ya Awari Krista. Ugaskia, Magana Chibi Yawa. Ama Allah Ta'alaichi, Abun Chinsu, Dawatan Suyahal at the Gari. Wataamu Lagina Utu, Kitabu Hilu Lagu, Wataamu Kuhilu Lagu. Wal Musalati Bilal Mu'miyad, Wal Musalati Bilal Lagina Utu, Kitabu Hilu Lagu. The one thing halachi yana na, the mupi yong malamai, you don't know suna ganan babu ali kitabi, mushin kai ni wai, so bo the sun chi ala de hukuna, a magas kiamu ganan shini su in de ali kitabi, then chumba yau boski de wan na kiran, kuma ala ta ala ding de kiran su ali kitabi, kuma na ala susalim ya yam nu kuma ala de su akang ali kitabi, kuma da sun chi ala de ni ala wan de mo suna da de kan sun sun muslim da. Gaskiya magana shini suni ala kitabi. Meyesa ambasu di tabi. Wadda ki saa awaran sayi jay chanye jay awara. Yes, di tapama. Amma, idan kana sang tabi, abinna shawaran da anil sanyi bayar, shini ana awaran machini sabu da abu hudu, sabu da kenta, sabu da erba bangida, sabu da kudi, Sabo de kiau, ah sabo de adini. Si anu misalnya cik, kene mimi adini kau lah. Kau agak cik musim mewah buat cik kau, kau ikat kau ke bank, kau ikat pasu. Mana apa jiran kamu kau kucari juga. Tu inaga ansal lagi misalnya cik angkoba. Ama halachi, ya halachi. Kau agak cik angkalachi, aku agak cik adulah kerja kebal. Kau agak angkalachi. Aku buat dewa, buat dewa ni idam mai, ama amal ada mana abang saya cuti desi. Ama orang boleh cuti desi. Kamu ni nak guna iran yang luar nama Muslim ni, the party Allah cakap Allah pun ada di Muslim ni. Cari aje yang luar ni aje dah awak cakap sah. Dik kasang ahli kita ni, kamu bijir yang lain semua. Kamu dulu zona terus. Kalau kita ini ada, ini ada, ini ada, dah mungkin awal ish. Cari umat yang terus terus, tapi mahu terus terus dia mungkin nak cikun ini. Amak kena indah macam yang kasih. Kamu mungkin kena resi, dia kiri bawa, kiri bawa macam kah. Binang, kita tengah raga dia, boleh kita ibadah dia. Binang, bawa kanjara bawa kuna dia, saya mian kita. Allah esok ini. The question is whether it is permissible for a Muslim to marry a Christian lady. As far as Islam is concerned, Allah the Most High made it permissible. It is permissible for those who know that they can bear the consequences to marry them. Allah made it permissible their food and also marrying those who are chaste among them. Not everyone. Just because she is beautiful, you just close your eyes and go for her. Even among the Muslims, the Prophet Sallallahu mentioned that people do marry women for four things. Because of beauty, because of wealth, family background, and also because of a, uh, because of a uh, deen, that is the religion. The Messenger of Allah advised all of us that we should go for a Muslim who is religious. So even among the Muslim ladies, it is not everyone that you should go to marry. You should choose the best among those who are well-trained and well-behaved. What more of someone you share religion differently, she goes to her place of worship, you go to your own, she has her own manner of upbringing, you have your own. Again, in the end, Whatever, if you can, you know you can bear the consequence, it is permissible for you. But mind you, it is not everything that is permissible that one should do. If something harms you, even though it is permissible, you should avoid it as someone who is sensible. Wallahu alam. Now what is premium quality?
na warais mil suka dauki nauyin kawo muku na warais premium quality dan danon irin na daban ne ina ma abuta dillanci shinkafa da masu sen dai dai ko sari warai kuna iya samun shinkafar na warais a nawo complex kusa da next shopping center Kado district dake Abuja Nigeria kuna iya ziyartar ma ofishin mu dake floti mai lamba 870 gidado Idrisway dake Edo Industrial Area and Extension FCT Abuja kazalika kuna iya tuntubar mu kai tsaye a lambobin karta kwana sufuli 7 sufuli 8 37 da biyar tara tara ko sufuli 8 daya daya 8 tara biyu daya tara 7 biyu ko sufuli 8 sufuli 3 shida biyar shida daya tara 3 tara na warais premium quality shinkafa ta ce shinkafar ku ce garanti gangariya abinci daidai lafiyar jiki na warais mil na maraba da mai siyan daidai ko sari na warais mil suka dauki nauyin kawo muku 